sexy baby. Black and sexy baby. Black and sexy baby. We have the lovely Hillary Marie Norman. It's not Hillary. Haley, shit, my bad. I'm thinking of fucking Fresh Prince. Fresh Prince of Bel Air. I knew it. I knew it. Welcome to Black and Sexy TV's first ever all male talk show. Minute Man. I'll be your host, Jeremy McBride. You might know me as Judah. To my right, I got my man Desmond Faison. Yes, sir. You know him as Dude from The Couple. I got my man Andre Fuller. You know him as Jay from Roomy Love and Friends. To the left, I got my man Daryl Blaylock. You know him as Daryl from That Guy. You know I'm saying, I ain't gonna waste too much time. We'll get right into it. I know you've been watching, so you pretty much know how it goes. We select topics, and then we talk about them. You know what I'm saying? You get the real, uncut, 100% pure version of it. You know what I'm saying? None of that sugar coated shit that y'all get on view with all that other shit y'all watch. So, might as well get right to it. Dre, what you do, Dre? I'm a bit unorthodox, so I'm gonna pick two, and then we're gonna do the, the, the best of the two. Changing it up. Yeah. Changing it up. Who am I tell you no? Change the weather. Right up. What's it gonna be? Okay. Woo! Damn! Serious business? Let's go. Okay, I'm gonna read both of them. Right. And y'all tell me which one y'all wanna talk about. Because right. both of them Serious? are prevalent for not only Los Angeles, but just prevalent just in general. general. First okay. one is Is a woman who smokes a turnoff? What about weed? What about drinking? That's the first question. Okay. The second one is, why do men lie so much? <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to answer the second question. <laughs> 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 I want to answer the first one. First one. We don't, we don't I think that's not both of them. Let's answer this first. Let's answer this first. Smoke and drink? We're going to we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna get this out of the way quick. Why men lie so much? Because y'all men. Because we scared of the truth. Come on, bro. Right at the end of the day, hey. at the end of the day, y'all can't handle the truth. You know what I'm saying? can't handle that shit. My granddad told me. Why lie when the truth was there? And so what he means is that I can sit there and tell you the truth, but you ain't gonna believe me anyway. Sure. So I'm exactly. gonna lie. Exactly. <laughs> Let you know what you wanna hear. Lie. You know what I'm saying? Give you, give you that source of power. You know what I'm saying? Make you feel like you won that situation. When um, reality, that's not the case. Yeah, uh -huh. I think it also has to do with a maturity thing too. I know when I was young, I used to lie my ass off for yeah. no reason. Yeah, just lie. Just because. Yeah. And then you get older and you start seeing that when your mama told you when you was a kid, one lie snowballs into another mm -hmm. lie. Yeah, you got your lie real. cover up another mm -hmm. lie. You realize the effects of your lies, and then you chill out with all that. I yeah. ain't got that kind of attention span. <laughs> you just, you just, uh, I'm just going to tell the truth and let the cars lay where they lie. <laughs> yeah, but see, that's different when you kiss a woman. You lie, though, man. Everybody lie, man. Really, you can't say You don't want to hurt her feelings, so that's why you don't want to be brutally honest, but at the same up. time, you want to... Yeah, sugarcoating and lying is a little bit different. You know what I'm saying? Uh, not really. You spare, you spare her Have truth. <laughs> What's the difference? Though, you go out with a girl and then you ain't really feeling like that, so you don't want to go out with her no more. Right. And she hit you up and be like, yo, what's up? Well, you been stranger, you know, LOL. Right. You don't want to be like, yo, your <laughs> breakfast is home. <laughs> so you know, you just be like, oh, I've been, you know, I'm, 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 you know, working a lot. I'm, you know, that's sugar coating. Okay, right. okay. Not, well, 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 if you put it like that, I, I, respect, I respect it, you know what I'm saying? But. White lies a lot. Every version of a lie is a lie. You know what I'm I got, saying? I got, I got, a, I got a feeling we're gonna be coming back to this one. Yeah, this, this, one, this one's <laughs> yeah. So let's turn into this, this second one. Is a woman who smokes a turn off? What about weed? What about what about drinking? Cigarettes, no. Cigarettes, no. Weed, cool. Cigarettes, definitely. It's you can smoke crap. well with me, baby. Cigarette for you can me. You smoke well with me and drink. Why not? What about you? All yes. things in moderate except cigarettes, because cigarettes are just cigarettes are no time. Like, that's 2013. If yeah. you're not Zero smart enough not to smoke cancer, yeah. <laughs> and I ain't got that like that don't make no sense to yeah. me. Like if you like 70 and you smoke, cool. You know the rat pack and them, y'all was smoking at restaurants, it was regal. Yeah. Sound like it sounded like Marge Simpson. If you ain't going on a blues tour and you or, get your voice raspy, I ain't really got nothing for cigarettes. We all things in moderation. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be the devil's advocate. 
I'm gonna go ahead and well, we we I think we came to a consensus. Cigarette smoke is a wrap. That's right. Yeah, that's, that's, that's not right. That's that's so that's zero time. Yeah, chill with that. Zero time. I don't really I don't really like chicks that smoke weed. I don't and care I know for and it's, it. it's weird because being out in LA, everybody right. smoke weed. True. Right. I don't really feel I mean, that. I don't though. care I for it, but if she do, and she I mean that's the it's about pros and cons. If that's the only con I can find with her. I can deal with it to an extent. It depends how much she smokes weed. Now she blowing key, yeah. every on the weekend on a Saturday. I'm cool with that. But she blowing. Oh man, I got her to go home. Give me this blood. I mean, <laughs> man, hold on. You're lush. We gonna go to church. Let me this blood before I go to church. Lush, no, I got a problem with that. Man. Well, me, I think for me, I think for me, because I, I like I like the femininity of a woman. But right. for me, for some reason, smoking weed is very masculine to me. You, you know, you, you sitting up there, you getting that, that blunt. Manly thing. That's right. manly. Right, right, right. I, ain't, I ain't feeling that. I think that. it's all so things like in moderation. Like, I, I'm a square bear to the nth degree. It's ridiculous. <laughs> But like if a chick, you know, she excuse herself and go smoke. But I mean, right. she like, like you said, she's sitting there with a blunt and a forty and watching right. the game. Like, right. hey, I can't right. believe they men right. did that. Shit. Like then I'd be like, hey, so it's all, it's a way you do things. You yeah. mean like you can drink too much? Yeah. It depend, you can drink the wrong shit and True. look like a hood rat or look like lush. Uh, lush or whatever you want to call it. Or you can, you know, you might have yeah. a little glass of wine or whatever, whatever else like that. But. Yeah, she's sitting around just smoking, chain smoking, blunting, and screaming at the top of the world. Be like, that. oh, I'm good. So, so I, we, we feel like it's moderation. Moderation. Moderation for the, Moderation. Moderation. Well? I mean, everything in moderation, won't kill, you know, won't kill you. No doubt. Mm -hmm. Well said. Me personally, baby girl, you can smoke as much as you want. Maybe it's a free country. That's what it's here for. 420. Right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Please, you know what I'm saying? Just, just, you know what I'm saying? Just put a cap on it, ladies and gentlemen. Just, just, just put a cap. Know you, know your limits. Mm -hmm. I think that plays key. a big that plays a big role because yeah. even like the third the third um, point on this was drinking. Mm -hmm. You know, it's all right to drink, but a lot like for me, like the biggest turnoff is a woman who gets pissy drunk. Yes. I would never in my life see you in the same light. There it is. No more no pissy drunk women. I never have, and I intend never to. I might have as a very young man, but as an adult, I would never hook up with a chick that's even like. Kind of drunk. That's, that's yeah. right. For the first time. Sure yeah. For the first that's time. Good. Even if she, even if she's like cool, party yeah, yeah, drunk, yeah. I'm like I'm cool. Like you gonna have to be dead, sober. but right. sober. Straight look up. me dead in these look around. Know what you're saying. And yeah. be like, I want that right. thing. Straight right. up. Now from then on, right. from then on, you get a little tipsy. It might just get cracking. You know, right. because you might your inhibitions might be low. There you know, it is. The first time you got, I have one million percent consent. There we have it. So we come to the consensus that in moderation, it's all right. In moderation. Indeed. In moderation, ladies and gentlemen. You know, it's about that time in our show where we have to have uh, a oh, woman's oh, point of view because they tend baby. to have the last word. It's the last word section. We have the lovely Haley Marie Norman. And we also have the lovely Ashley Blaine Featherston okay, from hit show on Black and Sexy TV. Hello, Cupid. So you know, we got a lady, so we got uh, to make a spot presentable. This is all for you, baby. It's velvet. Hello, crush velvet. gentlemen. It's crushed velvet. Crush velvet. Crush velvet. Crush velvet. Crush velvet. Just, Just for you, baby. Just for you. 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 Just for um, on a fantasy football league, and I'm like, why would you lie about that? Like, <laughs> it's so weird wow. to me. It's so uh, weird, to me. especially because I think I'm a very like open and accepting person. Yeah. And so, like, there's some stuff that I'm like, that's just you. Like, but it is hard. Like, I do have issues with like people who like lie about stuff. And it has always been like guys who have like continually lied about like some of the dumbest stuff. Oh, fantasy but I always league. find it out. Like, I'm right. super into in in um, in uh, intuitive. And, and also intellectual. <laughs> and, and I'm very right intuitive, so I always know when you're lying. And I'm always like, why would you lie about that? It's so dumb. And I don't lie, which sometimes gets me in trouble because like, you keep I'm super honest about it. That's good. That's what we do here. We yeah. keep it 100. Yeah, we appreciate I, think that's, I think that's what keeps a lot of men from being honest. Like, you know, you get yourself in a lot of trouble for being too honest. True story. You know, Indeed. and, 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 and honestly, being too honest? Oh, yeah. yeah. Being honestly, too honest is not the best part. Yeah. You can honest I agree. Right. You but can if you're honest with somebody, yourself right now with some but, yeah, but, easily. Yeah, you're but if you're best. talking with somebody or you're with somebody who you don't feel like you can be honest with, and that's not the person like for you. Oh no, 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 no. no, 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 no. Right. 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 Right.
that bites you in the ass later. Totally. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Absolutely. Wait, that guys know. are the worst not liars. Always. Like, no. women women are good liars. I would like, that's agree. Why, no, I, that that's why, agree with that. No, when women cheat, that's why, I know it's not just about love, but when women cheat, they don't get caught as easily as when guys cheat. Like, women are good liars. Think, so do you want to be with someone that's dishonest throughout a relationship? Men, we, we lie on the spur of the moment. We lie on the spur of the moment. Is that, it's, yeah, and all the stuff that we're saying. It's not about a relationship. It's just saying sometimes there's a necessary lie that needs to be told. Hey. There's exactly. a whole song by uh, Nora Jones to be, <laughs> to, be, to be off the chart for a minute. Nora Jones got a cold song. The whole song's about like how we got along before you started making me tell the truth. She's like, if you want me to tell the truth, I can tell the truth. Right. This is gonna be a problem. Wait, wait. Uh, let's, let's be clear. Women be lying their ass off too. Yeah. yeah. People lie. Oh yeah, yeah. You, the, oh baby, you the best. You the best I ever had. <laughs> I ain't Shut interested up. in nobody else. That's a you lie. Know, person lie. That, that, that I is ever a lie. Been well, what are you supposed to? Sex sounds a lie. Are supposed to tell? Like, be honest. No, it's the same no, thing. Like no, it's the same thing. No, no, no. And you're sleeping with them, but they're like, oh, it's like, but they're not like the best you've ever had. What are you supposed to be like? Oh, no, you're number six. Keep <laughs> <laughs> but, but it's still a lie. 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 To protect the feelings of the one right. straight up. No, but they lie about, about what they're doing you on the side. Him, you don't Wait, tell him he's number no. six on the list because you want to protect his feelings. No, I mean number six on the list of like order of like people who the like best. did me Put good. Like, you right. know what I mean? Like that's all the only but way. Yeah, I mean, but you're, you're protecting his feelings. Yes, right. but no, but you guys we lie don't, we so you li- could keep girls on the side and like like lead people no, on. That's, no, that's, you're assuming. You're no. you 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 are, you are assuming. No, I never lie and keep girls on the side. I just kept girls on the side just and not lie straight up. But the reason that dude lied to you about playing fantasy football because he didn't want to hurt your feelings. So here's the deal. Right, I, have, I have a scenario. I have a scenario for you guys. So let's say you're dating a girl that you that you really like, right? But you're also dating like two other girls too. Right. So if home girl that you really like, she's like you know the main one. If she says, hey, like, are you dating other people? What do you are you gonna say? I keep one hundred. Yeah. I, I, I do. I keep two hundred. I keep. I keep. Okay, okay. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. You you said, what are the, what are the instances in which you feel like lying oh, is oh, lying is important? Y'all appreciate. <laughs> y'all appreciate lying right to the point where you're like, oh, I can't really. <laughs> you. I appreciate you telling me the truth, <laughs> but I'm gonna go Straight somewhere. Up. I'm good. No, no, but you. At the end of the day, you do appreciate it because then that guy is no longer wasting your time. Because if you're wanting exactly. to commit to him, and if he likes likes you, but like doesn't want him to commit, then then you can move on with you your life. I'm just that. saying the reason the dudes lie is because they don't want to cut off their nose. Sure. Right. I'm not that dude. Like I'm, <laughs> like, I'm in the driest of the driest spells ever. Cause I don't even. Well, have a but <laughs> oftentimes in life. Oh wait, I'm, wait. Right. <laughs> Too much. All right. No, no, hell no. Fuck that. It's real. That's what we do around here. We keep one. No man in dry spells. All right. Don't worry about it. It's all right. Right, you're gonna get through it. Oh, I'm good. I'm, yeah, I'm confident. Good looking. I think, I think a lot. I think a lot of time too, men lie because it's what comes natural. When you, oh when no, when that's dumb. No, listen. Oh, hold on, hold on. Let me give me a second. 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 <laughs> men lie so frequently and so often and for so long, it becomes a habit. Yeah. If you do anything in your life over and over repetitively, it becomes a habit. Sure Lying is Master actually shit. one of those things. No, but that's ridiculous because that's using a crutch. As an adult, it's not a you make, it's a no, no, listen, it's as an adult, you have a decision to either continue patterns from your parents, continue patterns from your youth or whatever, and then step into your own greater person that you are. Like me, I'm a vegan. I was raised my entire life eating meat. My whole family eats meat. I decided for my own reason not to become vegan. I broke that pattern. It's the same thing with lying. It's the same thing with anything. So that means you don't you like could, me? that People could use that as an excuse for everything <laughs> to hold themselves back. To be like, oh, well, this is what I've been doing. If we just all kept doing what we've been doing, not making, we would I'm not never making, elevate. I'm not making an excuse for it. What I'm saying is, if you do anything continuously yeah. for a, a long duration of your life, it becomes a habit. That's a fact. That is a fact. That's a fact. You gotta break the cycle, man. Yeah, break the cycle. That's a whole other topic. So at the end of the day, day ladies and gentlemen, what is what is what is the the consensus? What do we come to? What what is valid? Men lie, women lie, no. men lie. Everybody lie. Yeah, men lie. Numbers women. don't. Numbers don't lie. Straight up. That's the only thing I don't lie, y'all. It's numbers. numbers. Everybody here, yeah, we all lie. You know what I'm saying? It's natural, human nature. You know what I'm saying? We don't want to hurt anybody's feelings. You know what I'm saying? So, you got to give them these gifts, man. They came not a problem. Give them the gifts. Give them the gifts. Black and sexy apparel. You know what I'm saying? Black and sexy apparel. No problem, baby. She caught it, too. I think she did. Yeah. Oh, look at the top. 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 Look at the top.